Hi, um, I'm Charles Richardson and um, I make sort of um, video animations, um, one of which I have here at the ICA um, New Contemporaries exhibition. <laughs> Could you tell us a little bit about um, the processes behind your video animation? Um, generally, it begins with very spontaneous performance work, which um, involves sort of strapping things that I've got around my studio onto my head and um, playing around with the sort of performative aspect of, of contemporary life and how that can be sort of shown through a literal sort of uh, arrangement of things on me and then that is then sort of through a, a longer process taken into a, a virtual world and it produces these sort of strange 3D heads that float in in this sort of weird world. I don't really want to say that they're, they're just video, they have a very sculptural look to them um, and that's what I'm interested in, I'm interested in this, the sort of border between something that's sculptural and object-like and film. So the objects you choose, are they reflecting certain aspects of your personal life or is this just something that's more broadly relevant? Um, this, they tend to be just things that are just around. In the studio when I was at the Slade, they would just be hanging around um, like supermarket bags. Um, things that coffee cups and chewing gum and things and it, it was sort of a reflection of what was in my immediate environment and that's what I'm interested in. I'm not interested in, in a, a kind of conscious decision making process. I like that sort of the contingency of, of, of finding things and, and them sort of being brought into your, into your creative world as it were. And this is the second ex big exhibition this year for you. Yeah. Um, where, where were you before this? Um, well, a few months ago I was showing at um, Victoria House in the New Sensations exhibition and um, actually I won that so um, it's a really good thing because I got a studio out of that and it's allowed me to sort of carry on being a professional artist I suppose. Yeah. And where do you want to take your work from here? Are you going to develop into more into technology? Um, continue with the 3D uh, art? Mm, I'm very interested in installation and I've got the privilege in the, ne in the next year to do a few solo shows and um, I'm hoping to incorporate video installation with also with objects and i um, not too sure about it yet but um, I'm interested in trying lots of things out. I don't want to get sort of sort of stuck in, in one sort of way of doing things. So as I'm, you know, as I'm, I am an emerging artist at the moment, I think when you're emerging, you've got that possibility to try lots of things, but when you actually get to a sort of bigger level, then, then it's more difficult just to change, I think. So at the moment, it's, it's, my, it's my platform to try things <coughs> again. Yeah. It is filming and creating things on computer, more kind of a way of distancing yourself from having to put yourself out there, as it were, make yourself vulnerable. Exactly, exactly. I think my work is about, I think if it was just performance, it wouldn't have that, like you say, that distance and that otherworldliness, which is created through um, bringing the performances into that virtual world, which is not a fictive, fic fictive world for me. It's not a fiction, it's, it's as if those figures were just just went through a porthole or something. I mean, that sounds cheesy, but yeah, for me, I'm interested in that, 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 that second world and those performances in that second world. If it was just the performances alone or if I was to print those things out as objects, it, that's not interesting for me. I'm into sort of 
the grotesque and um, absurd and theatre of cruelty and, and there's something about Hitchcock that in my work as well. I like I like the devices in Hitchcock's work where he's very conscious of the spectator and that's for me is really important as an artist that my work has an effect on the spectator.